Okay, we're just going to start by parting our hair and we're going to use the heart braid technique, the heart parting technique. You just make the first curve and then you bring it down just like your 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 parting the curve. So you just part it the first time and then the second time. So this is the first parting for the curve and then I'm making the second part here which is for the second curve so this is what it looks like it looks like a heart braid yes so when you're done with that this is what your number three shape should look like it looks like a heart so once you're done with that you're just going to part it into two halves just like i did you part it into two halves then from the end of it you would part a diagonal line parting one half into two halves so what we are doing is that we are, we are parting the whole head into four halves that is each curve will have two then once you're done with that you just start braiding from the left part of the patterns that is from the beginning part at the under the base you just start weaving it down to the um next braid that you're weaving it from the inside of the hair to the other braid that's from one curve so once you're done with the first half you curve it into the second part of that same half so here we're just almost we are almost done with the first part once you're done with the first part you start braiding it you curve it into the next diagonal line for the right part of the curve so that's what i'm doing here i'm just weaving it into the second the first diagonal line of the second curve and then once you're done with this first diagonal line you weave it you curve it into the last diagonal line so you make your number three on the hair and this here i'm done with our number three and this is what it looks like if you put the end of the braid together it will look like a heart braid so this is the number three and here i'm just going to incorporate it i'm just going to weave it down to make it a braid so here I'm done with the head and this is what the number three braid looks like 